Hi, this is iPod Tutorial Dudes, and today I'm going to quickly show you how to get past the Android lock. Um, you can get the Android lock for free from Cydia, but you'll need a, one of my sources, I'll have a link in right here. And if you are using HTML5, you will not see the link, so you'll need to go into the description and I'll have the link there. So, um, t um I'm going to show you how to get past the Android lock, so if you forget it, if someone changes your Android lock password, and you forgot it, or... Yeah, like, or they won't tell you or whatever. Um, this is without restoring your iPod. The easiest way to get past the Android lock. There are um, two ways to get past it. I'm just gonna show you the easiest way because it'll work. So, all you need to have is SBS settings for this to work. You can get this from Cydia if you don't already have it. I'm pretty sure you'll have it if you're Joe Booking already. So, um, so just get um SBS settings and um, I do not support anyone stealing an iPod and trying this because I don't support stealing. So. The first thing we're going to, um, so, here we go, let's lock it, so, here we go, so you don't know your Android password, so what you're going to do, you're going to slide your SPS settings, click on the little button that says power, and then the bottom one says safe mode, so, um, I'll have to, here we go, so we're going to touch safe mode, and now what it's going to do connection closed yeah yeah is it's going to little circle is going to appear on your screen just a second it's just respringing into safe mode and once you get into safe mode all you have to do is slide the slider across the screen and boom you can say OK, and then and now you got through your iPod past Android Lock. Now from here you'll have to go to Cydia, and there from here you'll have to go to Cydia and uninstall Android Lock. Um, the other way, um, there is another way which um I, I don't really need to show you um is a way to do it without uninstalling, but you have to have open SSH and it's just a little more complicated. So what you have to do is uninstall um you have to uninstall Android Lock. Then you have, then you go back to normal mode. Then what you'll do is then you re-get Android Lock, and it'll work just like it has before. So I mean, this is a really, really easy thing. Um, so you just basically go to safe mode from SPS settings. Then you have to uninstall it. Then you go back to normal mode. Then you reinstall it, and that's all there is to it. So that's how you get past the Android Lock. This um works for any operating system, any iDevice. And that's really all there is to it. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, don't forget to rate, subscribe, and comment.